Hey, what's up guys? Today, Apple has seeded the fourth beta iteration of iOS 12.2. So we're going to talk about this as well as this week's major jailbreak updates for the iOS 12 jailbreak scene. So this and more in today's video. Now the main new features include some new Animojis Beta AirPlay 2 support for third party TVs, Apple News for Canada, and a few other minor UI adjustments. Now one major hidden leak is this. Apple is preparing for Hey Siri support on the likely second generation of AirPods. Now it's confirmed the FaceTime bug that was patched in iOS 12.1.4 was also applied in the third beta iteration of this software and is also included in this release as well. All right, well, let's cover our bases today for the jailbreak fans out there. Do not update to this if you intend on jailbreaking. There really has been nothing released for iOS 12.1.3 or above, and the upcoming iOS 12 jailbreak utility is only going to be for users on iOS 12 to iOS 12.1.2. So if you're not on those firmwares, definitely downgrade to iOS 12.1.1 beta 3 as that's still being signed. And once you're on a supported firmware, stay there and install the tvOS beta profile to block over there updates. Lastly, things in the jailbreaking community are looking fantastic right now. So to start off with this week's update, the major one that I want to talk about is yes, Pwned Own is still changing his status. It now says Pwned Own is forging PACs on A12. A12 support is going to be coming, but not before A7 and A8 support. It sounds like beta 40, when it is released, will support A7 through A11 devices. And he says, special thanks to Sorik for updating Cydia Substrate and making this possible. So it sounds like Sorik has successfully updated Substrate to run on A7 and A8 devices. That was one of the main things we were waiting on for that jailbreak for those devices. Now, with this completed, Pwned Own will entirely focus on the jailbreak utility supporting A12 devices like the iPhone XS, XS Max, and XR. Well, in other awesome news for A7 and A8 users, well, Sparky IB Sparks on Twitter has released his own kernel exploit. He says it's the one he used in his previous demos. And following this up, it sounds like he has updated this exploit to fully support A7 through A11 devices. Now, interestingly enough, if we take a look at the iOS 12.1.3 release notes, that is the version this exploit was patched in. Um, so it's not going to add any further support for 12.1.3 or 12.1.4, but it sounds like it's just going to add yet another exploit for iOS 12 to 12.1.2 that may or may not improve the reliability, the stability, and the success rate of the jailbreak utility functioning on the first try. But this is the exploit in question. It says a malicious application may be able to elevate privileges. And again, this is a kernel level exploit on the iOS was 12.1.3 release notes. Anyway, jumping back to Twitter real fast, the reason why I bring up IB Sparks' exploit is Pwned Own has taken a liking to it as well. He says he's currently implementing the match swap exploit by IB Sparks in Uncover for 4K devices. The exploit takes a second or less to run and has an incredible success rate. So this is just fantastic once 4K support is out for the iPhone 5S, iPhone 6, and iPhone 6 Plus, this is going to be great news because the exploit and the jailbreak utility is going to run extremely well on those devices. Anyway, I will be sure to keep you guys up to date if, if any major news comes out pertaining to A12. I loved it down below here. Uh, Pwn did a recent survey on his Twitter. He says, what's your guys' main device? And it sounds like the majority of users are on the latest iPhones and are really looking forward to jailbreak. So I will be right there with you. This is my iPhone XS Max. I'm super excited to jailbreak this. Anyway, guys, if you don't have time to watch these videos, definitely check out our jailbreak status checker pages on Best Tech Info. They are dynamically updated, so you guys will always know and be notified when the jailbreak utility is updated to support your devices. Definitely before you go, like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, but until next time, this is Tony, signing out.